I am sorry guys that last recording uh, ended abruptly I forgot to set my timer uh, I've got a 10 minute limit on my video recordings um, I forgot to set my timer and I forgot to leave the battle kind of early so I could do a little after battle analysis and I tried doing that right after it but then the video ended luckily it didn't come me off right in the middle of a sentence and um, let's get straight into this i16 late model and uh, try it out and uh, now that I've got my timer on I can tell when to end the video and uh, let's hope we can survive this battle and let's hope it's short because battles in this game they tend they can be short but they can be long and oh look at that I am top tier that is nice and let's see if we can find some other guys uh, baby juice I know is another youtuber uh, for world oh laptops is in this game again if you saw he was in the last game he was on our team um, no, it doesn't seem to be any other YouTubers that I know of, but, um, because when you start playing World of Warplanes, your account from World of Tanks comes over because of that Wargaming Unified account, um, which is pretty nice. Now, as you can see on this aircraft, down below it, I have some rockets. There's six of them on this aircraft, and there were four on the I-16 early model. Now, rockets... They can be used for going up against ground targets, or they can be used um, going when you're going head-on with an enemy aircraft, and you can just press R a couple times and fire those right off and destroy them before they come straight at you and uh, prevent a collision, I guess. Now, being top tier, uh, maybe I should have went towards the middle, but an F2F, that guy's got to be pretty easy to kill. Hit. If we can get him. Very maneuverable, very small aircraft as well, so it'll be very hard to hit. And as you can see, there's someone on my tail. You are losing control of your aircraft. Increase your airspeed. Whoa! Just got rammed there. BF 110B really not the best choice to go after seeing how he has a tail gunner so we'll go over here with this uh, this guy now I am so I'm gonna ask Except someone to clear my tail because I am just being torn yeah, up and this might be a pretty short battle so we'll go after this P-36 here Target hit. turn right around Oh my. As you can see, I am one of the only people right here, and my team is not... They aren't really helping out much in the way of fighting, because there's not any people over here. I'm going to try and fire off some rockets to try and hit that guy with some. It's just very unlikely that you know why not. Oh, oh, don't crash. Oh, dang it. <sighs> Um, if you look down here at the map, we were being owned because almost the entire enemy team came right here, and, um, we, we were outnumbered. You probably, I had probably four or five people on my tail. But, um, so that was a pretty short battle. Um, uh, laptops killed me, <laughs> funnily enough funneling, if that's a word. Um, he killed me. He was on my team last game. Hmm. Um, yeah, it appears we're going to lose this one. Mainly because we're extremely outnumbered. We are dominating them with our superior ground targets. But, uh... Run. But, uh, yeah, I guess I, I've got the BF-110Bs, and I know that thing's got a lot of guns, and my aircraft just did not have a lot of health. It's uh, a lightly armored fighter. 
that's kind of where the Russians went, I guess. I mean, they had lightly armored fighters, and then, uh, laptops are saying, sup, you two. And, uh, it's, uh, yeah. Um, then they have those heavily armored, which is, they've got polar opposites, and then some of the others, it's almost the same, maybe. But, uh, But yeah, just give my channel. But um, so yeah, that was a pretty quick battle. Uh, extremely outnumbered where we were, but as you can see, laptops. He got two air kills, so that's pretty nice. Um, I did not do too well in that battle, and I don't think I'll be able to get another one in within this recording time. I will have to start another recording, but uh, we might be able to if I'll just like stop the recording and then add it on to another one so what do you say we uh, go try out that BF-110B uh, let's see there it is uh, let me just check see how much more experience I need um, how much more do I need oh wow I can research it now but that's not a wise choice I don't want to use my free experience so I, I need about 2300 to research it now if I get a really good battle I could get it in this so this is going to be about a 30 minute long video sorry guys but I don't know 30 minutes 10 minutes I I might just add this battle into the next video if I make another one this soon but uh, we entered the battle uh, here we are let's see where are we ooh pretty low but I tend to do better when I'm a bit lower on the uh, the tier side now look at that ooh firepower uh oh he must have some upgraded guns but uh let's see if laptops is in our team again um doesn't seem to be doesn't seem to be any other uh youtubers in here either um there's baby juice and a, a zombie guy but um But uh, let's see how this battle goes. Um, this map, it tends to be a higher tier aircraft map, but um, Good hunting. it, uh, I've, it doesn't, I don't seem to do very well on it. I don't know. It's maybe, maybe it's all the water. I don't tend to do very well around water, I guess. But, um, It's, uh, well, some guy doesn't appear to be happy to be on YouTube. Language, man. But, uh, okay, there's the enemy. Let's see if we can go after this guy right here. He's going after a friendly, which means he'll be preoccupied, and we can get in there, and ooh, he seems to be one of the top tier guys on the enemy team. And we can sneak in there, get some good shots on him, if we don't stall out because he is in the... Okay, this guy. We'll go after him. Uh-oh. Okay, our, my tail gunner will get him. Maybe. This guy is definitely more maneuverable than me. Being that I'm in a big, heavy fighter. Now, I don't put any bombs on the, this plane. Mainly because I want to keep it light and more maneuverable. Be, even though it's not maneuverable at all. Um... As you can see, my tail gunner's firing off. He appears to be going after me, which is, uh, I guess, kind of good. But he's in a nice dive now. We'll see if we can get some strafing shots on him. He is going very fast, and he's fleeing right now. Frame rate's dropping a bit because of all the bullets flying. I appear to be taking hits. I damn... Okay... My fuselage is damaged. Yeah, there's a BF-109E on my tail. That can be dangerous. And I'm about to crash! Ah, you kidding me? This is why I don't like this map. Um, there's just so many things to crash on because the islands, they really just, just stick up. Like, they are basically just mountains. And it really is annoying 
when um, you're in a dogfight and my aircraft just was not maneuverable enough. Maybe if I deployed my flaps. Uh, maybe if I deployed my flaps. Yeah, back in another recording. Ooh. Oops. Okay, there we go. Uh, back here again. Um, maybe if I deployed my flaps, I could have maybe avoided that mountain, but it seemed a bit unlikely. It looks like we're going to win this one. Um, I'll probably end it after this battle. Uh, but yeah. Tell them my channel if they want to watch a video. Um, I don't know. It's just because I haven't played the game in so long. I, I have uh, a whole like three days. I really do lose my mojo <laughs> um, when I have when I don't play a game for a long while. Um, let's see if we can get into the action. I'll find a guy who's oh man, look at those guns. Dang. Um, let's see if we can find someone. All right. A P39. Oh, that's a uh, a premium. I think I believe that's a tier five premium for the Russians. Um, I don't know. I think I'll be buying the HE100 premium for the Germans. But uh, yeah, that guy just was going down. Now um, we are being dominated, but there's one player left on their team. Let's see if we can find the top tier guy in uh, on our team. Okay, Kale and his BF109F. This guy, two kills, pretty serious. Yeah. And uh, Jerry Strider is talking about uh, fighters thinking they're ground attack. Um, you can do that at the end of a battle, but if there are still enemy fighters or ground attack aircraft, if there's any aircraft left and they are visible on the map, then you should be going after them. Because you are a fighter. Now this guy seems to be up in the sky. Oh man. Um, nobody seems to be. Uh, nobody seems to have the altitude to go after that guy. So uh, they're either going to have to let him come down, or really boost their engines and get up there. But uh, okay, it seems this guy he could be going in uh, P-51A. I believe that is a tier six aircraft, maybe. Um, let's see, player Axel, yeah, tier 6. Very high up. Now, uh... Let's try, okay, there's P-39. Uh, yeah, this guy, he is going way far up, and it appears this P-39 could just, could be stalling, but really can't boost all the way up there. This guy is, has some altitude. Um... So, this could end. Uh, let's see if we can get to the guy behind him. Yeah, he's right here. Man, 1,200 meters up. This guy must be at, like... Oh, he's coming down. Dun-dun-dun-dun. Um, Alright, now we're getting some action. Let's see, I'm going to try and follow him, but... I really would like to have the same information down here when you're in spectator mode as you do when you're still alive. Um, mainly because it, it's useful to have information and, and the, the target tracker would be a good thing in spectator mode as well. Uh, mainly because to see it's easier to follow if you want to continue after the battle. Um, it's just nice information to have uh, if you really want to follow up and to keep track of the battle. And uh, there we go. Uh, Kale. This guy right here, he just got the last kill. Uh, 472 experience, not a lot. Um, 8,900 credits, that is minuscule compared to what I usually earn in this aircraft. But um, I'm probably going to end it here. Um, this is going to be a three recording mashup. I'm going to have to do a lot of video editing, so you guys better like this video. Because I'm pretty lazy when it comes to video editing. But um, this has been World of Warplanes with the Krusty Cupcake. And uh, stay crusty, guys.